And now a CBS 4 News exclusive and congratulations go out to the village of El Portal Police Department for being recognized with a national award for excellence. CBS 4's Peter Danch is live in El Portal with a profile of the police chief who three decades ago on the big city policing experience and I think I know who you're talking about here Peter. Well, that's right, Elliot. You know, some of you may remember David Magnuson from his 30 years to the Miami Police Department. He is among a series of Miami police officers who have gone on to become police chiefs at smaller cities in Miami-Dade County. I can tell you he has not lost his passion. I was told I was hyper as a kid, and I'm still hyper. So, and I think that serves me well as, as, as a cop coming up the ranks, certainly as a police chief, because as you are, people will follow. David Magnuson is pumped up about police work because... If you want to be comatose, you're going to have comatose cops. Yeah. Since May, the 57-year-old Magnuson has been police chief of El Portal, right next to where he spent decades in Miami. When I was commander up here, we would come over here all the time anyway because they used to have a trailer park over there that was pretty high in, in crime. After graduating from the police academy at 22, Magnuson worked with other chiefs like John Timothy at the Miami Police Department from 1985 to 2014, then served as police chief in Havelock, North Carolina for three years. The greatest compliment I get from any officer, young or, or old, is that you, you never change and you were always a, a cop's cop, a street cop. So I take that as a badge of honor. I've never lost my, my love for the street. Magnuson's department recently won a National Ring Award given to small police agencies. He supervises up to 20 officers calling on his magic city experience. You come up in patrol, then I'm supervising, then I'm commanding patrol, I'm doing narcotics, I'm doing robbery investigation. El Portal has 2,200 residents. We had a rash of car break-ins. And then we made one arrest that went away. He boxed as an amateur for 26 years in refereed matches and uses boxing metaphors when describing El Portal. And if we're going to be a bantamweight, then we are going to strive to be the champion. You break the law, we are going to go after you. You have to remain vigilant to the fact that, listen, people are getting victimized from time to time, and they look to us uh, to, to help them. Now, in his spare time, the married father of five children likes to cook, travel, read, and write, and spend time with his two grandchildren. I've covered David Magnuson on News Story since 1993, and he is showing no signs of slowing down. We are live in El Portal, Peter Danch, CBS 4 News.